welcome. Um, thank you so much for joining me today. I wanted to go over some stuff that I picked up um, on Friday. I went to Target. I went to Rite Aid and CVS and Ulta. So we'll start off with what I picked up at Target. Um, I got two NYX uh, lip liners. One is a wine color and one is red. Um, I really like the way the red one goes on. Um, this is like so nice and smooth. They're, they're both NYX, but one, the red one goes on so much smoother than the wine one. Um, pick those up at Target. Those were about $7.99. And I got from Pixie. I already used it, so I opened up the box. And um, this is a liquid um, eyeshadow from Pixie. This is fourteen ninety nine, and that's like a like a mauve, um, almost like a mauveish brown. And it goes on so nicely; it lasts all night. Um, that was super cool. And then I got this from Cody Airspun, the setting powder. This was seven ninety nine, and I have this on right now. And and I've seen a lot of people really like this. And now I really like it too. Um, it's very, very nice under your eyes. It smells amazing. Um, it has a little uh, poof in there when you open it up. It's got one of these little things. I just put that to the side, dump a little in the cap, and I apply it with my beauty blender. But um, that's what I picked up at Target. Not so much at Target. And then I got at, um, at Fenty, at Sephora, I went a little Fenty crazy. Um, I got her setting powder um, in the color Butter. And this stuff smells so nice. Oh, my God. Oh, it's like heaven. It's like heaven in a jar right now. Um, this is $34 um, compared to the Cody Airspun, which is $7.99 or $7.99. Um, so it's a little bit more. I like it just as much. I would say I like them both the same. They each give me a little bit of a different glow. Um, this has got like a little bit of a yellowish tint, and this one's got more of a beige tint to it. But I do like them both very, very much. I also got two of her highlighters at Sephora. I got the pink one right here. It's got the color Ginger Binge and Moscow Mule. And I got this one here, which is Chills. And it's got like a blue tint to it. And I love them. They're like, bam. I'm not wearing these today, but holy cow, when I wore the Chills the other night, I was like, boop, boop. Boop, shining away, shining away. And then I saw these glitter pop. I was like, or glitter flip, not glitter pop, glitter flip. And what these lipsticks do, I only got the one. I wasn't crazy about the other colors. So I just got this, um, it's like a magenta type of color. Um, I got this one and you put them on and then you go like that. And glitter comes out, not comes out of your mouth, but glitter forms on your lips. So it's glitter flip. You put it on, flip, and then you have glitter. These things are so cute. I absolutely love them. They are so cute. And um, I know um, a lot of people have probably seen them on Facebook and stuff, but I was like, whatever. They're super cute. I like them. And these are about $15 each. So um, that's what I got at Sephora. And then I went to um, CVS. And at CV, I went to two different um, CVS, sorry. I went to two different CVSs. And um, first I got um, at CVS, I, I got the Wet n Wild Primer Spray. And I've been using that every day. I really like it. Um, I use it along with my primer, but it's so nice and refreshing and it helps, you know, hold in that makeup. And these are like three or four dollars. So why not? And I'm going to be doing a Wet n Wild um, video with the Rebel Rose collection. And I got all Wet n Wild stuff. So I picked that up. And then um, I got this from Physicians Formula. This is a skin booster vitamin shot. 
Um, this is for restoring. Now, I'm using this right now along with my Physician's Formula um, Rose All Day Brightens and Tightens. I'm using this for my jowls and my under eye. I've been using the Physician's Formula Brighten and Tighten and the Rose All Night Moisturizer for about a week. So I just picked up this, the, the Reboost, the Restore, and I'm going to use them all together and hope that it can tighten up my face a little bit. So I use the Rose All Night at night, and then during the day, I'm using this first, the Restore, and then this Rose All Day over top of it. Then I go in with my primer spray and my primer and my makeup. So this Rose All Day leaves a nice rosy tint to your skin. It's so beautiful. You could honestly just wear that. Like if you wanted to go out with no makeup and just put that on your skin, it would look so pretty. It really, really does. And then speaking of skincare, I picked up a L'Oreal um, Pure Clay Cleanser. I had gotten a sample in Ipsy and used it all up. So I picked up a full bottle because it really does cleanse your face. It gets, it detoxes and brightens. It removes everyday impurities. And when you wear a lot of makeup and stuff, you need something like that. You need something to lift all that dirt and all that crap out of your skin. So go Physicians Formula. I hope to God it, it helps me and it works. So then I picked up some e.l.f. Um, cleansing cloths because I love e.l.f. and these are cheap. They're like $3 and who doesn't need those? We always need those. And then I got some Ardell Studio Effects um, eye eyelashes, the Demi Wispies. These are my favorite ones, the Demi Wispies. Um, I picked up some more eyelashes today when I was at Rite Aid, but I, who, I need eyelashes. I wear them every day, so why not? And then from NYX, I got um, eyebrow prime, uh, eyebrow mascara because I was using the Urban Decay Double Down Brow and I was only using that alone. And my eyebrows seemed a little puffy, so I figured eyebrow mascara, that would definitely help me out and keep my eyebrows in place. And then I got a Joa brush, which I actually have been using. I put it back in the box. Um, it's super soft, and it really does help me with my makeup a lot. Um, this brush is, um, it does. It just says eyeshadow brush, Joa. I, but I like it a lot. I, it, it's been helping me get my makeup nice and, um, you know, in a smaller area. That's what I got that brush for. It was more for a smaller area. And then to go with my Wet n Wild Rebel Rose collection, even though it comes with lipstick, I picked up two liquid lips from Wet n Wild. I wore this red one the other night. I must say, I had to apply it quite a few times. Um, right in here in the inner area, it really like came off a lot. And then once you apply it a couple times, um, it gets really cakey. So um, it probably doesn't do that with the lighter colors. You probably don't have to reapply it so much, but for $5, you really can't go wrong. So that was it. That was a good buy. Um, then I picked up another Wet n Wild contour palette. I used mine every day. I use it every day. So I wanted a backup because I use it every day to contour. I love Wet n Wild's contour palette. It's amazing. This thing is $5 and you get the tan and the lighter color. I, I swear. I use it every day. Every day. And then in terms of my drugstore makeup video, I got this eyeshadow palette from Revlon. We're going to do a purple theme, I think, for my drugstore um video that I'm going to do with only drugstore makeup. So check my channel out for that because it's only drugstore makeup that I'm going to be using. So let's see what I got at Ulta. This is my bag from Ulta. It's a little bit bigger than the other bags, but some of the products are a little bigger. So let's let's just say that's why. Um, so from Ulta, I got from Real Techniques, I got this, uh, this got a bunch of uh, beauty blenders in there. One is missing because I took it out to use it, but um, I love how it came with the three beauty blenders, the two bigger ones, and then this one is for more contouring, but um, this was $20. Not bad. A original beauty blender alone, which is just one is $20. And I think the Real Techniques Beauty Blenders are 
they're great. I don't know. I think they're great. I don't have a problem with them. So then, um, from NYX, I also from got this eyeshadow palette off Tropic, uh, for these bright, beautiful colors. Look at those colors. This is $20, but they do sell it in the drugstore too. So if we decide we want to do something a little different in the drugstore video, I have these two palettes to choose from. And speaking of bright colors, got a couple different things of bright colors in here. From NYX, I got, this is Glitter Eyeshadow, Glitter Liquid Eyeshadow. It's purple to go with our purple theme for the drugstore video. Look at that. So I got that. And then I also got, if I could find it, Purple Mascara from NYX. And Purple Liquid Liner from Wet n Wild. So we're going to be all purpled out. Also, I got the Wet n Wild Blue Liner and from NYX uh, Blue Mascara. Just wore those the other day and you should check out my video that I'm going to post with the blue uh, eyeshadow that I did. It was gorgeous. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. I mean, it came out so nice. And I had the um, blue liner from Wet n Wild and the blue mascara from NYX on. Just on my lower lashes, I used the blue mascara. Oh, it made such a difference. And then lip-wise, I picked up a couple of, if I could find the other one, um... This is from L'Oreal Infallibles line. These were buy two, get one free. So I picked up three liquid lips. I got 372 Petal Potion, 115 Blush, which is more of a gloss, and 354 Nudist. And I'll go ahead and swatch my hands with those. Now, you can't go wrong. Buy two, get one free. They ended up being like $6 each. I mean, what a great deal. And these stay on very nicely. They, I love these L'Oreal Infallible um, liquid lips. They really stay on nice. And I'll go ahead and show you that swatch right there. So that's nudist. That's... Um, Petal Poison, and this one here is Blush. Uh, if you're looking at my other swatch here, that is what I got at TJ Maxx. So they're kind of similar, but a little different. A little different. Then I picked up for a uh, highlighter these Maybelline Master Chrome. I got, I already have a pink one. I wanted a purple one for our purple look with the drugstore. These are amazing. The shine is, they compete right there with Fenty and they're like a third of the price. Um, these are amazing. I love those. And because I bought all my NYX stuff, I got a little uh, handy dandy makeup bag at Ulta that came with a liquid lip as well and also it came with a little lotion um I don't know where that went but it was up there it was it's a little L'Oreal lotion and um that was super cute to get this for free I mean just for buying NYX stuff I was gonna buy the NYX stuff anyway Oh, here's the lotion in the bag. L'Oreal. It's supposed to go on your face before your makeup. Hydrogenous um, is what it's called. So tiny, but hey, it's free, right? So along with the funky colors, I decided to get some reds. I got NYX Vivid Brights Eyeliner. And that, you obviously, you need a tool to go in and put the eyeliner on. And some red glitter. I thought, how much fun would that be to do, like, a red eye? Maybe with some yellow or something. Um, and to go along with the red eye, I bought... Um, this is from L'Oreal. And this is the Voluptuous Burgundy um, Mascara. I love putting colored mascara on my lower lashes. I, I mean, I because I wear the fake lashes on top, but then you throw a color on that bottom, and it just makes your eyes go bam. It's like super, I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. And I'm probably going to end up with another burgundy because I'm waiting for Elf's uh, new release to come out. And I think there's a burgundy mascara in that one as well. But um, back to like skin, not skincare, 
hair care. Let's do hair care. I picked up these from Biolage. They're little tiny bottles. Um, I, I had so, uh, some tiny bottles, some samples, and I really like what that does with colored hair. It doesn't wash the color out. It's like keeps the color locked in there. And then also for hair care, I got Living Proof um, shampoo and conditioner. Now, these are supposed to be really good. What it's supposed to do is clean your scalp. It's it's a charcoal um, shampoo and conditioner, and it's supposed to clean your scalp. So I thought, why not? Because the other shampoos focus more on your hair, where this one focuses more on your scalp. And we need to get that off of us. We need to lift all that crud off of us in hair care product and whatever else. And then last but not least, I already opened it, but I got a jade roller. Um, this was on sale. I think it was like $14 and it came with both of them. And I've been using it with my physician's formula, um, you know, skincare products. I thought, I can use, you know, do it all, do that with the physician's formula. And I feel like I see a difference, but I don't know. Maybe you could tell me from my first video, do you see a difference? It's only been a week. Comment in the comment section and let me know. And that is it from my shopping haul. I uh, hope you enjoyed watching and I hope you check out my other videos in the future where I'm going to be posting um, the Wet n Wild R Rebel Rose, Anastasia's Riviera collection. I ordered ColourPop's um, new collection and it has come out with a foundation that we're going to try. Check out my Tarte Shape Tape. Shart. Shart. Ah! My Tarte face tape video um, and my L'Oreal Infallibles video that they I mean it says 24 hour wear L'Oreal Infallibles 24 hour wear you did it you my L'Oreal Infallibles foundation I get so many compliments on that foundation um, so go ahead check out my other videos subscribe to my channel hit the like button and comment do you want me to try something do you want me to do something a little funkier do you want me to try a certain product let me know I will do it um, and just um like my videos and I'll keep making more. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day.